Hey, what's going on guys? It's Joel here with as many reviews as possible and today we're going to be doing a barbell cleaning video with the non-VOC version of Rust Patrol. In my last video I used the normal one. The problem about this one is that you can't actually get this one in California whereas this one is available in California. Now in the last video we also used primarily bare and zinc coated barbells. And in this video, we're going to be doing a hard chrome coated barbell. So hard chrome is pretty good for attenuating scratches, but when it comes to rust, it's one of the easy, most easily rusted barbells or barbell coatings that you can get besides uh, bare steel. So. If you ever have any kind of moisture on your chrome barbells, make sure you guys just wipe them down before you put them away and store them away. Um, so the main difference between the two rust patrols is that this one is legal in California, has no volatile organic compounds, and it's a little dripper bottle. But other than that, it should work the same. So just like we clean all of our barbells, I'm just going to use the rust patrol. I'm going to drip it all over this barbell. Then I'm going to go over it with my brass bristle brush. Um, you can use a stainless steel brush too on hard chrome and it shouldn't really do anything. But I would just use the brass. Uh, and then we're going to use a little towel to wipe it down. I like to go over it with simple green afterwards just to kind of get the greasiness off. But let's get started and see how this works. I prefer the dripper bottle over the spray bottle. It's kind of hard to get it out of the spray bottle, but the dripper bottle works pretty easily. And there you have it, the finished product. The non-VOC Rust Patrol worked pretty damn well. Pretty much just as good as the normal Rust Patrol. A lot of the dark spots that you're seeing in there are just dirt and stuff that I haven't wiped out just yet. But for the most part, the rust spots are gone. So Rust Patrol is a protectant first, but it's also a cleaner and a lubricant, and I definitely recommend it. If you guys have any questions about Rust Patrol, feel free to ask in the comment section. And as always, guys, thanks for watching.